We're here at Campus Dairy Farms. Uh, we milk about 480 cows. Before we were in a double 10 parallel parlor, and now we're in a 50 stall outside rotor. So the cows walk on uh, very smoothly and easily. So this is the future cow brush. Uh, basically, it's uh, a bunch of uh, bristles that are spinning. So uh, you pull the trigger and it's going to uh, clean each tit individually. Uh, first, it sprays some water with some cleaning agents. After it cleans with the water, uh, when you let go of that trigger, it's going to shoot some uh, air just to clean each tit as well and blow dry them. That way you don't have that water residue kind of hanging and dripping off of each tit. So after uh, the teats have been brushed and cleaned, um, the milkers get put on. Uh, you just need to push the milker up towards the udder and it'll start uh, pulsating and sucking air. The Demetron 70 displays the cow's number as well as how much milk she's giving. You can put the milker on manual or automatic depending on the cow's need. Um, if the cow uh, has an issue, it will also alert the milker to kind of show a little bit more attention. Once they're done being milked, uh, stop dropping milk. Uh, the Demetron 70 realizes that and it'll pull away and drop off uh, the milking unit itself. The cows love uh, that rotation and movement of the parlor. They also, uh, cows are herd animals, so they love being milked together, side by side. Uh, as you can see, they're staying there, chewing their cud, very relaxed, uh, enjoying themselves. So before the cows exit the rotary, they actually uh, get a uh, post dip, and we also check that they've been milked up properly. If the cow's still milking, the parlor will wait until she's done milking, then drop the unit, and then send her off into the barn. We really like it. We like the simplicity of it. We like the consistency of it. Uh, that was, those were the big reasons we, uh, we chose a rotary.